Good Tuesday morning, everyone. Meteorologist Stone Schaefer here with your July 25th one-minute forecast. Highs this afternoon got us sitting in the mid to upper 80s, all the way up to the triple digits once again out to the west and maybe to the south. We'll have to keep an eye on this. Cloud cover could affect how warm we get. If we have more clouds and sun, some areas may not get this warm. Obviously, that sun comes out really going to help us warm up quickly through, through the day. Uh, SBC outlook for this afternoon does show us we do got this area of non-severe out to the west into the north central of a south central up to the northeast has this marginal risk and we do have this slight risk down to the southeast. Uh, biggest concerns for a day, hail development, large hail could be possible and then heavy winds, heavy rain obviously as some of these storms develop. But again, if that cloud cover builds, may have some tough times developing. We'll keep an eye on it, see how the atmosphere sets up during the day uh, for some of these storms. But we're going to have rain early on through most of the morning. We can see rain, maybe some thunderstorms uh, starting out to the west, moving into the central portions. Then by the afternoon, uh, we see there could be some just hanging around from the backside of that system as it moves through today. As we get into the night, clear sky, some rain up to the north. We could have actually a, a few thunderstorms wanting to pop up uh, to keep an eye on the sphere uh, rating of those as we get into the day tomorrow. Uh, but we could see some hail, heavy rains, heavy winds as we get some thunderstorms tomorrow afternoon as well. And then we get to Thursday, clear for the most part. Now we can't count out some isolated thunderstorms late into the day. Uh, but by Friday, we actually look to be maybe a little bit wetter in the morning. By the afternoon, we should dry off lots of sunshine there. And then Saturday, uh, dry for the most part. Actually, could be the driest day, the least amount of rain chances we have. Uh, then Sunday looks to have another round of isolated showers and thunderstorms moving through the region. 10-day uh, temperature trends, well, it got us in the 90s still the next three days, but lower 90s, maybe even the 80s Thursday. Then back to the 80s Friday and stay in the 80s all through next week.